Big Stevie Cool, 1872, back again. If you can hear roadworks, no need to fear, because James Tavernier could be on the way to Rangers properly, real this time. Reports dropped last night about apparent strippancy, strippancy, stripping of the captaincy, whatever you want to call it. I prayed for this, and it happened, all right? Because this is what, I mean, I had a comment on Fog Football last night, from, I'm going to presume a Rangers fan, that said, you hate Rangers more than the, the Thames, is what I'm quoting there. And it's like, hi, because I'm celebrating our worst captain in history. You know, leaving, or well, getting stripped the captain. People need to wake up and realise that, see James Tavernier's stats? They do hee-haw for me, and they do hee-haw for you. They do hee-haw for the club. You know, see, unless he's bagging trophies with them, who, who honestly cares, man? You know, who, who honestly, who honestly cares? At the end of the day, I, I, I do not get it, right? You know, if, if you ask, like, Boyd Miller, Boy, uh, Boyd Miller, McCoist, strikers, right, that have played for Rangers here, will take 50 goals off your tally, but you get five trophies. Are you trying to tell me they're not taking that? Of course they're bloody taking it. So why should it be any different with the right back? I've no, I've no, I've actually no idea why people are so defensive of this guy. You know, I, I mean, I don't wish ill health on the guy for James Tavernier. He still sells. He still scored crucial goals. But it's time to, it's time to let go. It's time to just accept here. You know, some good moments, Tav. But overall, you failed us. You've absolutely failed us in one of our most bad, I mean, our worst period ever. I get it, he wasn't the captain since the, the you know, the lower league, League Two, etc. But he came in the championship and here, I wish the guy well in his future, but I'm not going to sit here and pretend that James Tavernier is the holy grail and the, you know, the difference maker to us do doing things because, you know, he's been here. Do I feel unlucky for the guy a wee bit? You know, he had a great Europa League run. Things happen though, you know, things absolutely happen and you need to get over it and you know what, it's not like he bounced back and went, alright, I went two trebles in a row after that Europa League, no, you, you, what, what, what did you do next, the next season? You led our team to hee-haw, alright, he needs to go, as for Connor Goldson, it looks like he's getting stripped of vice captaincy, yeah, brilliant news, it tells me they're both away, I don't see how these guys get stripped of that and continue to play at Rangers, you've seen you know, the rumours are, oh, Connor Goldson gets dropped and then he throws his top ram. What's that going to be like when he's stripped of this, you know? I think they'll both be away. Um, I think it's great news, man. I mean, it, maybe, that mean, maybe it means there's actually, like, proof in the pudding of those um, Saudi bids that just seem to exist. I mean, I think they're all fake news, them, right? If Gerard truly wanted these two... You would get maybe, like, two or three false rumours and then something would actually... Like, a concrete bid would actually come in. But see, for the most part, there's been hee-haw. So I'm walking through jagged needles here and it's, it's no ideal. But Jake likes it, don't you, Jake? Tell you what he doesn't like, though. James Tavernier still being captain. And also, the replacement, Super Jack Butland and goal. I couldn't think of a better, a better captain. Uh, well, I mean, I'd probably, I'd rather the captain be out on the pitch, but if you don't have someone suitable out on the pitch, then I've no complaints with the goalie. Guy gets it. Guy gets what it means to play for Rangers. Leads by example. Perfect fucking role model. Guy barely lets us do a cup final, brother, brother, brother. But forget about the cup final, all right? Next season is a new season. And it's time for Rangers to act. Who will the vice captain be? I'm thinking Dujon Sterling. Um, you know, a lot of candidates for these roles, I would, dare I say, left. Not that I would have wanted John Lundstrom or like a Jack to be captain. Especially Lundstrom, Jack. I mean, if Jack could stay fit, I think Rangers captain was on for the guy, but... The one for the guy anymore. No, you're not my VP anymore, no mad. It's uh, I once Chibs Telford said to Jack's Teller, but um, yeah, that's it. Quick wee video discussing Rangers things, uh, captaincy, all that good stuff. Um, yeah, I think it's, I think it's good. I think it's very, very good. I think this is good news. This. You know, this shows me that Clement is serious about changing things. It's not just words. It's not just, I'll bring in a few of my players. No, he's changing things up and down. 
you know, and I, I don't see I don't I don't see how we can get worse for this movement, put it that way.